I'm gonna show you really quickly here, the Excel dashboard, because again, I think this is the best way to learn programming. So I created this dashboard for you. There's a beginner uh, level, an intermediate level, advanced, or all tracks. Okay, so the advanced stuff will do visual basic here, intermediate, a little bit less so. And I've set this up so that uh, you can track your progress. And of course, I'll teach you how I made this. And there's no code in this particular one here. Um, and so I've got uh, help videos, a ton of help videos. I actually have a help video set up for every single icon and every single function and all 400 plus formulas. Everything is covered. And again, this is only gonna go to my MBA students. And if you bought the MBA before, you get this included. All right, and so there, there's just a hell of a lot of stuff here uh, that I go through in a lot of detail, okay? Including downloads of files, uh, et cetera. Tons of different really, really fun exercises uh, it, it is, as well, which, which I think you guys will absolutely love. And again, I add uh, 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 a lot of visual basic stuff here as well. So let me, let me show you how coding works with Excel. And again, this is the best way to learn programming, okay? We'll start with Excel. And then I'll teach you Python and other stuff as well. Again, I'm a nerd. I used to be a programmer for years back in the 90s, and I've been doing it in my spare time forever. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're actually going to create code here, and then we're gonna change the code. And the beauty of using Visual Basic for applications, which, which ships with all versions of Excel, the beauty of it is that it always includes a developer mode, okay? so. What I'm gonna do right now is right here, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna record a macro and we're gonna change the code really quickly and you'll have this incredible aha moment in a second. All right, record macro. And I'll call this Chris button bold. And we can set up a command key for it if we want to, I won't do that. So we're recording right now. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna type here Chris, enter, and then I'm gonna make it bold. Okay, good. Now we're gonna stop recording and we're going to assign a button to this code and I'll show you the code in a second. All right, so the button will be called, I'll just use this one here and here it is here. So let's name this button here. Okay. We'll name this button here, make Chris. <laughs> I can't even spell my own name folks. I don't know if you should take my courses. Make Chris bold. I'll get rid of the six at the end. There we go, good, all right, cool. So watch this. Now, when I click this button, it's gonna enter in Chris and make it bold right here. See, or actually it didn't make it bold, but that's okay. So what we'll do now is we can actually go and change the code if we wanted to. So you click here on Visual Basic and you can see here the code. So basically, like I was saying with the pencil before, we took active cell dot formula equals Chris, okay? And then we made bold true. So if we want, we could change this code here and do Mike, okay? And make bold false, see if this works. There we go, good. So you can play the code here, or you can go back here to um, Excel and actually run the code itself. So watch this. This will now say Mike. There we go, Mike, right there, cool. So that's how we do it. And so this will be coming out later this year, again, just to my MBA students, this is not gonna be an individual course and, and I hope you enjoy it and I can't wait to start teaching you uh, programming. Now, in, in my MBA degree program, I've got five main sections and the sixth section I'm adding is technology. Those five sections are as follows. They're entrepreneurship, okay, where I teach you how to start a company sales marketing and communications, where I teach you how to network and a bunch of other stuff, use social media products as well. There's economics management and strategy, which is like working at a consulting firm like McKinsey. And I used to work at Accenture. I didn't get a job at McKinsey, I tried. There's also finance and accounting, okay? And then there's personal growth. Okay, now the sixth one is gonna be technology. Again, I'm really excited about it. It's coming out uh, later this year exclusively to my MBA students.